All right, guys. So if we're able, to, need to be able to find the dragon cores as quickly, we need to be able to split up into teams of three. Three teams that could be able to go after each dragon core, right? So me and Aaron are going to go after the dragon core that's in the mother garden. Nia, Ryu, and Sora go look for the dragon core that's in the land of the lost things, and Kai and Wildfire go to the. Go to find the dragon core in the wildness. Wait, me with her? Um, Lloyd, are you even pairing me up with someone? Because all I see is a big jerk right here. Wow, you're the one to talk here because you're the jerk here, not me. Like, why exactly could you, like, pair me up with Zane or something? Or just have Zane go with Wildfire instead? Like, they'd probably get along quite well. Well, it's important that at least one of us stays here in order to take care of any merge quakes that happens. But... But why can't you have me stay and take care of the merge quakes? Or just have Toyo do it and just, and just like have Zane like come with one of us? Well, it's true, but we need somebody to stay here and be able to study those portal gates. And besides, Zane has Mr. Frohickey to keep him company while, he, while we're out getting the dragon cores. Me and Aaron will take the bounty. Nia and Sora are going to take both Jiro and Sora. The t dragon Sora. God, I always keep getting those two mixed up. And Wildfire and Kai, you guys take Heat Wave. Alright, boys, let's move out. <laughs> Look at the almighty and all feared Lord Raz now. Now who's feared and almighty now? <laughs> oh, jeez. Wrapped in. Our force is ready to go out and get those dragon cores, right? I demand an update. Then why, uh, yes, Empress. Yes, they are. Good. Um, um, Empress Beatrix, I got a question. Like, uh, don't you think we're, like, focusing too much on the ninja? And don't you think we should just go back to hunting dragons, don't you think? The ninja defied me, humiliated me. I want to make them pay. And no one is going to stop us from hunting down every single dragon in the merged earth. Oh yes, I'll send everybody on the way. I'll, I'll have the good emperor. Do you need my assistance with anything, Master Zane? Well, not right now, Frohiki. I need to repair this device that can be able to analyze the portal gates. But I'm missing one piece. A Wyconium coil, a, w a very rare element, with an indestructible- Oh, I actually know quite the place for that. You see, there's a junkyard down in the crossroads that has tons of parts. My coin of coils aren't really that hard to find there. Well, yeah, not after Lop and Jago had, like, hoarded all of them for his little mansion. I don't understand why he broke contact with us. Have we really been gone for those many years? But me going, like, as this could probably bring some attention to myself, especially since the ninja, since it's been reported that the ninja have long since been gone for years. So a ninja suddenly appearing in the crossroads could probably draw some attention to myself. I need a disguise in order to go down to the crossroads to retrieve the Wyconium coil from the junkyard. Then what are we waiting for, Master Zane? Let's head down to the crossroads and retrieve this Wyconium coil. Twister Wolf, Twister Wolf, we have found the scoundrels. We have found the thieves. Wait, do I have actually found the thieves? I'll bring them in. All right, Twisted Freddy, bring in the thieves. Dove. Uh, what are we even doing here? Wait, Twister Wolf, Fire Ninja. So you and this little brat here have stolen something from me. I didn't steal anything. Like, what even did? What even do you think that we've stole from you? You have stolen my family jewels. You're kidding, right? Well, they are they are gems, stones, as well as jewels. They have been passed down from my family for generations. And you two have stolen it from me. But wait, I didn't even know that Twister Realm was even part of the merged realms. Well, you see, the Twisted Realm is one of the, of the is only one of the sixteen realms. 
And ever since our realm merged with your Earth, we have are now part of your Earth. All right, that definitely makes sense. Like you guys did, like your realm did merge with Earth during the merge. But I don't get to why exactly you're accusing us of stealing your family jewels. Like we didn't steal nothing. We didn't steal any gems. We didn't steal any rocks. We didn't steal any gems. We didn't steal any like. Any, any of your family jewels. Well, if you're not going to confess, then we're going to throw you to the dungeon and face the mercy of the beast. Wh uh, wait, um, who, what's the beast? You don't know what the beast is? Twister Chica, bring in the beast. All right, Twister Foxy, bring in the beast. All right, Twister Barney, bring in the beast. All right, Twisted... Uh, uh, I... I guess I gotta bring in the beast then. Ding! Um, Twister Wolf, are you blind or something? Like, that's the beast? <laughs> that, that thing looks harmless. Oh, please. The beast is anything but harmless. He has a kill count of over 500. Jesus! Wait, but it looks so adorable. How, how do you think it does look harmless? Oh yeah. Hey, hey, Twisted Foxy, bring in a, a bring in one of the scoundrels. All right, we'll do. Here you go. This guy stole a nickel from from a store. I only stole a nickel. Jeez. <laughs> ah, 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 my my insides. Ah. Oh my fuck. So yes, if the two of you aren't going to confess that you stole my family jewels, then you'll have to face the mercy of the beast. But look, we, we didn't steal your family jewels or anything. Um, actually, I got a confession. I actually stole the family jewels. I thought it would be a funny prank. Um, Twister Wolf Lily, like, wants us, Lily, to, like, be eaten alive by a by like some bunny, and are you and you stole the family jewels. I oh, so you have stolen my family jewels? No, it it wasn't me. It was just her. Yep, it was all just me. I did have some sort of sick prank. S prank? We could have gotten killed. So that was a prank. All this for a prank? Seriously? What? It's funny. Us nearly dying is a funny wildfire. Now, you go and return the family jewels to him. And it have to. Yes, you do. And don't have to. Yes, you do. Da, da, da. Yes, you do. Da, da, da. You do realize if she doesn't return us out my family jewels, then she's going to end up being publicly executed. Oh yeah, well bring it, this wolf guy. I mean, no, 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 no wildfire. Just please return his gems, please. <sighs> Fine. Here's your stupid gems, wolf guy. See, it wasn't that hard. All you had to do is just return the guy's gems to him. <sighs> You're such a buzzkill, Kai. Buzzkill? I'm not buzzkill. Like, I, I literally saved our lives. We could have nearly died. Thank you for returning me my family jewels. Now, let's shake on it. Let's do a little handshake. It's a, it's a twisted wolf tradition in the twisted realm. All right. I burned my hand. Oh. Twisted ones after them. Oh crap, crap. Swabba, what the hell did you do? <laughs> did the break. Come on, Wava, we need to get out of here. Stop right there. All right, right like the wind, heat wave. Let's head to the wildness. I will get you for this, wildfire. All right, let's go to the junkyard. It's a good place to find some parts. Well, look, Mr. Froggy has a new friend. Who is he? Wait, no, never mind. What are you guys doing here anyway? Actually, we'll hire to ask the same question. What exactly are you doing here? I'm sorry, have you lived under a lily pad for most of your life? You see, I've won- actually, this is actually my junkyard now. I won it in a lice game. Don't you mean a dice game? Nope! So again, what exactly are you guys doing here? We're here to look for a Wyconium coil. An almost unheard element 
with an indestructible- Yes, Marty, I know what that is. Like, you don't have to explain it exactly to me. We got a ton of Viconium coils in the back. I'll go grab those while you cough up the coins. Um, I don't have any coins. You what? Duh! <laughs> well, that was a quite frustrating experience. Alright, let's head to town, Master Zane. There are quite lots of opportunities at every corner in the crossroads. Ha ha ha, good thing I did the classic old handshake prank for on that wolf there. Ha, <laughs> you should have seen the look on his face. Wildfire, you know that elemental powers are nothing, but aren't, aren't just used for playful pranks, you know. These powers need to be used correctly, which is why, with great power, there comes great responsibilities. Oh, oh, I didn't know that you're the elemental master of boredom. That, you know what, fine, whatever. No more stops. We just go to the wildness and get the dragon energy core and meet back with the others. Because we have to go and save the world. Right, saving the world is much more important. Wow, you have some priorities, don't you? Look, if there's no world left, like, what else am I going to prank? Of course. Nia said that the core is protected by lava tides. They are, oh, me and Heatwave actually know the lava tides. Like, we are from the wildness, remember? Like, the wild, the lava tides are our peeps. Our homies. Like, they love me. Fuck you! No, no core for you! 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 For you. No no for you. you. These no are such no friends of you. yours! I thought you said that these guys no love you! Like, they know you by name and everything! Well, they do, actually! They even have my pictures everywhere! Wrong! Those pictures are up for us to identify the enemy! You! No core for you! Like a water poster? Ooh, wow, could have guessed. Anyways, Wildfire, what the hell did you do to make these guys angry? Well, they're not angry. Angry? We're pissed! We're super pissed! You made Lava Toad the Wise look like a fool! What, that boring old statue? Come on, they made him look better. And you guys know it. And she made our, our village smell stinky away from a nasty watermelon. Oh, please, like your village didn't smell even better with Mr. Lava Stinky over there. <laughs> I haven't taken a bath in 30 years. <laughs> See, I told you that they love me, and they always leave me awesome gifts, like these weird metal jaws-like thing. Look, th those are clearly bear traps. They're truly, clearly trying to catch you. Listen, uh, Lava Tides, you see, my friend here is is very, very responsible, alright? And I am of no way affiliated with her whatsoever. Like, listen, my name is Kai, the Ninja of Fire, okay? We're here to looking for the Dragon Energy Core in order to save the entire world here. Ah, oh, the Ninja. We've heard tales of the Ninjas way before the merge occurred. <laughs> For generations, our people have been tasked with protecting the Dragon Energy Core until one day, a noble hero would arrive in, in need of it. Are you that hero? Why, yeah, uh, uh, yes, I am actually the hero. Like, like I'll be taking that. Oh, wildfire, no, no, she is not blasphemist. You are not the hero that so desires the if that's so worthy of the Dragon Energy Core, with your terrible cry of, Ha ha, it's just a prank, bro. <laughs> See, I told you that they love me. They even use my catchphrase and everything. <laughs> we have no need to be doing business with anyone acquainted with the enemy. Look, that was the old fire. Well, yeah, she may be a, a jerk and all, but, but maybe we could do something to prove that she's changed a bit. Like... I'd say, like, maybe we can, the two of us can help clean up the mess that she made throughout your village. Whisper, 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 whisper. I have decided that for the, the proof that you have true, that the enemy has truly changed, you must, must indeed correct, clean up the mess that she had made. Both of you, Lava Tide, bring in the mess, bring in the list of, 
of the, the, of the things that they have to clean up. Okay, clearly it's not that bad. Oh, that's, that's a long list. Well, for how much stuff have you even done to them? Oh, please, I've done that all in just an evening. You want to see what I can do in an hour? That is our demand. Now, go and clean up the mess now. Alright. Does anybody have some brooms and pans or or something? Or maybe some, some soap or some buckets? I'll probably go and look in the janitor's closet. Don't worry, Zane. We'll find enough money to be able to afford those coils. Like, maybe you could have, like, a karaoke feature. Like, don't you have the Wait a minute. Excuse me, uh, you're not, huh? Dun. 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 What is going on here? Wait a minute. That's right. I've completely forgot what today was. That is right. Today is Zane Day. The day out of the entire year that we dedicate to Zane the Titanium Ninja. Wait a minute, there's a Zane Day? Well, of course, you're quite famous here, especially after you defeated that Overlord that one time. And, and besides, it's been an honor to, to be by you right now, even with that hat on. Wait a minute, this community event is dedicated to, Z um, to me, to Zane? Well, affirmative. Today, we engage in zany games, zany food, like eat a bunch of bolts, yum yum. And today, we've culminated a Zane alike contest, where we got a huge cash prize. Wait a minute, if we can participate in that contest, then we'd have enough money to be able to afford those Wyconium wy coils. I'm quite optimized that I'm going to win the contest. Well, I'm not sure about that, pal. I'll go and register you. La 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 la. I do not sing like that. Welcome everybody to the Zane Alike contest. Today we have we have Lobo, Mike, the DJ machine, and two newcomers. One named Susan Ninjago, and the other named Blaine. And for the finals today, we have a special guest from Shintaru, Counselor Glutch. Welcome, welcome, you're welcome everybody. It is quite an honor to be, to be judging these events. Thank you, thank you. It is quite an honor to judge this contest. You see, Zane and the Ninja had free help saved by people, the Geckles, from the tyrannical rule of the Skull Sorcerer. And that devilish skull has a door. And we became best friends ever since. I know him very well. Now then, let the Zames begin. I, I'm Zane. I feel my eyes. Yeah! 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 That is quite offensive. How does Mike still have a Twitter account? Now, next contestant. Um, hi. I am Zane. Boo! Boo! I have heard Zane's voice a lot, and that is not it. You have failed. Sue, Susie Ninjago, have, do you at least have anything that could be able to... to do you have anything that could probably be... Be that isn't like this guy. Um, I'm I'm Zane. I, I. It's quite nice to meet you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Beautiful, just beautiful little one. And I even like your costume. Ah, oh, well, thank you. I even made it myself. Well, it seems that you have indeed dedicated yourself to the contest. This round goes to Susie Ninjago. Yeah! Woohoo! Yeah! Now on to the next round, the Ice Alike Contest, where you'll be trying to hit these targets with your ice. Hopefully those cubes don't melt. Ice Blast, Loba Loba. Come on, Mike. What are you waiting for? Christmas? Like, just make me proud. Like, make me actually want to be a creator, Mike. 
but I do not use my talents for, I do not, I am not a weapon. I am a karaoke machine. Time to put this target on I. <laughs> I'm sorry, my bad. Hmm. I'm sorry, um, how old is this kid anyways? I don't think she's old enough to be able to participate in this. <laughs> what the? Yeah! 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 This round goes to Susie Ninjago. Duh. What even is this kid anyways? Susie Ninjago. Why does that name sound almost quite familiar? Now onto the final round. It's the tech-alike round. For this round, you must reconstruct this generator into something quite unique. Alright, this shouldn't seem too hard. I could probably be able to do this. Alright. Loba build. Loba loba. Oh my goodness, why did I have Mike participate in this in this game? Like, why couldn't I just participate instead? Alright, Susie, you could do this. Just prove to Mama that your that her teachings didn't go wasted on me. Party toaster online. Lobo Lobo. Yeah! Oh, yeah. yeah. I made a sideways generator. You see, I made the generator into a machine that can walk your dog, clean your room, do your taxes automatically. Um, what, Blaine, is it supposed to do something? Um, I don't know. I've been offline for years now. I think there's some updates that need to be, be installed. Well, you do understand that there is a time limit, correct? So say what? Now, Susie, what have you reconstructed your generator into? Well, I've reconstructed it into... Beep! An attack drone! What the... What the actual bee? That is the most... That is the most beautiful tech that I've ever seen you ever make! You are quite a talented youngster, young one. Well, of course, my mama is the smartest girl in the, w in the world, you know. Bravo! Encore! Somebody give this girl a Grammy! You are the most zane person alive! Oh my goodness, thank you, thank you, thank you! Thank you so much! You see, I would like to thank my pap, my papa, my aunt Toyo, and my mama, all in that order! You got to be kidding me. I lost to a child. A weird child with weird powers. Why does the last name Ninjago sound so familiar? Dang it, Mike! I thought you were going to win this, this contest for me. Next year, I will be signing myself up this next time. Okay, Dr. Krygor, only if I can go play some, do some karaoke. Uh, well, Lobo Lobo. Lobo, good luck. Lobo, bad luck next time. Lobo Lobo. Uh, another rotten melon. Yeah, I scattered these all throughout the village. I even filled some of these with death wasps. I want to make the village a lot more better and less boring. Haha, <laughs> sick. Dressing up that dumb little statue to look, to look silly is, is quite hilarious, don't you think? Good times, good times. Look, for you, it might be f all fun and games, but to them, it's not. It's not pranking, it's straight up bullying. Yeah, 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 whatever. Alright, we cleaned up your dumb little village. Alright then, I guess we should probably make amends and become friends, don't you think? Right, let's shake on it. What about no, don't, not, not the handshake prank again, not the fire handshake prank again. <laughs> What? Okay, what the hell was that for? <laughs> you thought that she could we could accept that she's changed, and and then you would clean up our village, and we would just lend you the the energy core. Well, no, you cannot have it. Thank you for cleaning up our village, by the way. Now the energy core is at the bottom of the pit of no return. 
Well, we kind of need that dragon energy core to save the world. I know, but you should see the look on your face. <laughs> well, it was fun while it lasted. Wait, Wildfire, we need to go and get that dragon energy core. Didn't you heard what they said? That's the pit of no return. And I kind of like, you know, returning. Well, this is too important, all right? The world is at stake here. Like, you can't just walk away from this. Well, I can. Just watch. See? Like, I'll tell the others that you probably just died or something. Like, they could be sad or whatnot. <sighs> Look, I hate to say this, but I realize I can't do this alone, and I probably need your help. Well, it's finally... Finally about time that you see that my leadership is your only hope. Alright, thanks for the help, hands. Now, Wildfire, do you see anything? Mm, nope. Melon! Hey, Wildfire, listen. <laughs> Emails later. Save the world first. Hey, Hans, can you take us any lower? Yeah, thanks, Hans. No mention it, Wildfire. Anyways, do you see that dragon energy core yet? Nope, I don't really see it. Well, it has to be around here somewhere, you know. Hey, Hans, can you... Maybe you could, like, turn us around? Hmm... See anything yet, Wildfire? No, all I see is the stupid golden sphere was looking thing. Wait, gold looking sphere. Wait a minute, that's the dragon energy core. Hands take us towards it. <laughs> ah, yes, we're going to retard so hard. <laughs> Whoa! Hands, what was that for? Sorry, the word return often makes me feel scared. What's what frightens you about the word return? Um, wildfire, do you hear that buzzing sound? Yeah, I think that smell might be infected or something. Infested or something. Yeah, remember when I said that uh, that like some of these mel wild melons were infested? A uh, hand, take us out of here. Ha! <laughs> ha! That, that was quite easy. What the? At last, you notice that your precious item that you've been seeking has been stolen by a mysterious and all down handsome stranger. Uh, Dorama, we know it's you. Oh, rat! How did you know it was me? Stage hands! Oopa doopa doopity! I got another puzzle for you. Now, don't the mighty Dorama with his stage hands. Now this is your curtain call. I sure hope that my sister is having a better time than this. According to the spirit, the doorway to the to the dragon core should be down here. Beep. Huh? Well, that doesn't sound good. What's even going on with me? Have I really been gone for that long? Uh, um, hi there, mister. I, um, came here to give you this. Wait, this is the reward money, but, like, kid, you, you don't have to do this, like, a, I'm guessing, like, a kid your age would, would do anything just to have this kind of money. I know, but I don't want the money, though. You can have it. I know how, knows how much you really tried your best to, to try to win the contest, so I thought I would do a nice thing and give you it. I guess the ninja really meant a lot to you, too. Like, like my pap and, and papa told me all all kinds of stories about the ninja. Like my pap told me, like they they fought alongside the ninja. Huh? Your, your pap? Yeah, my pap. His name was Lalpa Ninjago. The ninja all of a sudden disappeared during the merge, shortly before I was even born. And I just wish I could have met them. So I was inspired by the ninja to, to do good in Fazbear City. 
to be a hero just like my heroes, to carry on their legacy. Well, they sh seeing as they did leave a... As we did, uh, I mean, the ninja did leave a huge remark on, on the world. I think you can be able to fill that, that void that the ninja once filled. You mean that? Why, yes. Why, thank you, Zane. Huh? You, huh? I thought she said something. Good news, Mr. Frohickey. We got the money to be able to buy those Wyconium coils. Why, good. Now let's head to the junkyard, Master Blake.